The furry four-legged members of area law enforcement agencies have new protective vests. It's all thanks to a grant program for the Tippecanoe County Metro K-9 unit. News 18's Brittany Tyner was there at the Mollenkopf Athletic Center as the dogs showed off their new vest. Brittany? Dan, the vests were on display as the dogs sniffed out illegal narcotics and took down a suspect in a bite suit. These new vests will help protect them as they take these skills to the streets. Every call could be a canine call. That's why these canines with the Tippecanoe County Metro Canine Unit are prepared for the line of duty. Who's a good boy? Good boy, Bluffers. That's a good boy. Six of the ten canines that make up the unit were rewarded with more than just a tennis ball Monday. They received new protective vests. Say if we had a barricaded person inside of a, a, a building or, or a house where they were armed. Um, in that case, it would be beneficial to have a vest for a canine. The unit entered a grant program and worked with vested interest in canines to get the vests. Each one runs about $1,200. Never want to put that cost on the canine officer. That's why it's important for us to have donations and people, you know, give a little more, you know, to help get the vest for the dogs. And the canine officers are grateful for such a thing that protects their four-legged partners. It lives with the family. It goes to work with the police officer every day. And they essentially become one together. The K-9 unit is made up of officers from Lafayette, West Lafayette, Purdue Police, as well as Community Corrections. The six K-9s needed vests because they currently had ones that were outdated or they were new handlers or K-9s and they just didn't have them yet. Brittany Tyner, News 18.